Hello everyone, Dan here from the Next Issue Podcast. On today's video, I'll be doing a manga review. Now, we don't normally review manga on a weekly basis, but when something comes out on the Shonen Jump app specifically uh, that really catches my eye, I want to definitely talk about it. And in this video, we're going to be talking about Dogs Red. This is a new manga that came out on Shonen Jump uh, with story and art by uh, Saturo Noda. Uh, translation by John Weary, lettering by Steve Dutro. So Shonen Jump actually dropped 11 chapters of this uh, on November 8th. So make sure to go check that out. I'm only going to be talking about the first chapter because it's a really nice introduction. So let's talk a little bit about the man this manga and, and uh, some of the stuff that how it came to be. So uh, in this manga, Ru once Chase figure skating glory. Now he chases redemption in the ice hockey rink. Uh, if he wants to go wild at skating, isn't it better off an ice as a as a hockey player? 2010 Hokkaido figure skater Shikawa Ro, who scored the highest score of all time in the finals of the All Japan Junior Championships, suddenly goes on a rampage for some reason. He is disqualified from competition he would have won and is permanently banned from figure skating world. Ro, nicknamed Mad Dog Prince, finds himself in the hockey town of Tomakomai, the ice capital of Japan, a natural pond rink created by Mother Nature, a story of super recovery that turns every setback into a blessing. Uh, so this is the same mangaka from uh, Golden Kamui, if you're familiar with the, with the work. Uh, and also, it looks like, from what I read online, this is kind of a reboot for an old series that of his... Um, called Supi Namorada. So I'm not familiar with that series, but you guys know I love, I mean, I love anime, but I mean, I love manga, but I specifically have been really interested in sports manga. And I think hockey seems like a very interesting place to go uh, because like with many manga, you'll learn a lot about the sport. Uh, but also knowing that the, the main character is a figure skater, uh, obviously there's a lot of drama already kind of built in. Uh, there's a lot of tragedy as well here that you'll see in this first issue. Uh, yeah, Rose had a rough, uh, but I'm very interested in following his story. So let's take a look at some of the preview art. And I just grabbed a few of the fair, the first uh, panels. As you can see here, I really love the art. I think it's very well-defined, very clean lines. Um, I love the character expressions as well. And then once we get into the actual skating, you'll see. But the... The world building gets done very quickly, right? In these first opening pages, we see a lot of Rose past, what happened to him. And like I mentioned, very sad stuff. Uh, but all that stuff kind of is what's driving Rose for this performance. And as you can see, so I put the, the panels are in the manga order. So make sure you're reading from, uh, from right to left. Uh, and I just really like when the skating starts happening. I love the expressions of the of the crowd. I just love the figure skating itself, uh, how dynamic it is. There's a lot of movement implied in the inks. Uh, so that's very, very cool. Uh, next, we get to see a few more pages of skating. And this is just me trying to convince you to watch this. Uh, I also wanted to include a shot of the team uh, in the hockey in the, in the new town uh, because I know they're going to be a big part of the story going forward. So. I, I was I really enjoyed this first issue. I think it's a lot of fun. Uh, I think like I said, there's a lot of a lot of good drama involved, a lot of things to endear you to the character. And there's some there's a big confrontation and all this is being driven by this beautiful art uh, that builds this world. So very excited for this uh, to kind of keep reading this. Like I said, the, there are 11 chapters and this will be coming out. Apparently it looks like weekly because we we have a notice on the app that in six days we'll get more chapters. Now, I don't know if they only dropped. I don't know how many they're going to drop in advance uh, or what the frequency is going to be for this. So if you know anything about that, let me know down in the comments because I'm very invested. Uh, and if you have heard of this or if you've been reading this before, uh, maybe the original Japanese manga and you end up watching this, uh, let me know. I don't know if this is a day in, day in manga. Uh, but either way, I'm very excited to get into it. So if you have read this uh, chapter, this initial chapter, let me know down in the comments what you thought about it. As always, thank you for watching, everyone. Remember to share, like, subscribe, hit the bell so you know when we go live. 
That is most Saturdays, 10 a.m. Central Standard Time. Stay tuned. We have more comic reviews, trailer reactions, TV recaps, all that fun stuff here in the channel. Thanks for watching, everyone. Bye-bye.